Well, hey guys, this is Grace of GB Maltese, and I hope you are doing finer than frog's hair. As you can see, <laughs> we're off to see the wizard. Yes, we are. I love the Wizard of Oz. I even have a custom-made pin from Bistro Blanks of the of the Emerald City, and when I saw this on Diamond Art Club, it's like, it was a no-brainer for me. I'm like, okay, I'm trying not to buy too much, but when I saw this, it was like, uh, look at the Emerald City. It's beautiful, and the, it has all of the characters, except for the wizard, of course. But he's inside the Emerald City. I've already taken these things out. Um, I have not had one that has had the new toolkit, so... We'll, we'll look at this real quick. I don't spend a whole lot of time. because <laughs> That painting is what we're mostly interested in, right? Yes. Okay. We have our pen. And we have a couple of placers. Okay. We have a clear glittery diamond painting tray. We have uh, a wax caddy with two pieces of wax. We have a squishy for the pen. Um, we have a cover minder, which is a rose. And we have some washi tape. Oh, that's pretty. It's got, oh, that looks like it's got poppies on it. Oh, poppies. Puppies, puppies! <laughs> sleep, 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 my dear. And then you got lots and lots of baggies if you want to get your painting up in that way. And the nice, sharp little tweezers. I use these things for all sorts of things, not just diamond painting. So let's put that away so I don't lose it. Uh, oh! I just just figured out what this is. This is like a little thing for your tray. It closes it up. Awesome. When I first saw it, I was like, what is that? Pretty cool. Alright, let's just get that out of the way. This. This right here is all I'm worried about. Yes, sirree. My daughter loved The Wizard of Oz when she was little, and we, I don't know how many times we watched it. It's always been one of my favorite movies. I still like to watch it. You know, it comes on once a year. I uh, have to have my Wizard of Oz fix. Okay. Oh, it's so pretty. Look how pretty it is. Look at that. So beautiful. And it flattens up very quickly for the Diamond Art Club, Art Club canvases do. They've got that nice, it's a nice canvas. Look how well this washi tape goes with this. Ooh, nice. Now, I saw someone mentioning that the Wizard of Oz's arm is kind of cut off. I can fix that. I just put a few more green and black or whatever color I need I can fix that. No biggie. That's too minute to bother me. Look! And look at the Emerald City. Oh my gosh, it's gorgeous. Just gorgeous. And the puppies. The puppies. And let's see. Let's move on over to here. We have 53 colors. And we'll look at those real quickly in a moment. And we have seven ABs. Anything 150 below 150 is an AB color. And uh, I can't even get that in focus. And you can see. Look at that. Just look at that. And that goes up to number seven. And Diamond Art Club canvases are fabulous to work on. Let's look at the drill fill. 
so you can just see how easy it is to read very easy yes I purchased this last Saturday and today's Friday I already have it like I gotta show it gotta show it today I love this it's beautiful oh my goodness do I have any other Wizard of Oz fans out there I love the Wizard of Oz okay and then we have a sticker here and then we got stickers that I will put on to my Elizabeth Ward containers because that's my favorite way to kit up is with Elizabeth Ward so these are all stickers and they will stick on there and someone gave me a fabulous idea so they don't stick too hard they said they put a piece of washi tape down first and then put that on top smart I don't remember who told me that but thank you if you can comment below if you were the one I don't goodness I can't remember I hardly remember what I ate yesterday now let's look at ooh, look at this deliciousness oh yes look at that red wow that is some gorgeous red beautiful now Okay, we'll look at them very quickly. I don't want to. Okay, we have an AB here. Then we have these are okay. Here's another AB. Ooh, look at that pretty purple. Okay, and we have some. All kinds of gorgeous colors. I always have such shiny drills. These are square, if you didn't notice. I just I finished a square, um, the hummingbird garden. Gorgeous. I've got to I've got to still make a video on that one. Oh, look at those gorgeous ABs in pink. Wow. Okay, here we go. Here we go. More ABs. Ooh, that's beautiful blue. So, that's one set of colors. Okay, then we have this kind of a dark brown. Let's go to this strip. We've got lots of colors in here now. Oh, wow. Look at those ABs. Beautiful. Probably goes on that yellow brick road. Lots of purples here. Oh, that's gorgeous. Nice rich browns. More purple. The sky is kind of purple. And we have some more reddish color. Green. Ooh, yeah. Gorgeous red. Beautiful. Purple. And then we got some more pink there. And our last strip. Ooh, okay. We got some more um, ABs. You can tell what color these are very pretty it's gonna be a gorgeous piece okay AB here a lot of times we have white ABs going. not very many of that one and these are just just a few of these colors here and that will make it just gorgeous one thing I noticed about this I thought was so cool looking at it is this it's got kind of like um, an arc 
right here going from here all the way around like there is an arc it's almost like a rainbow but without really any color but the sky is purple and we have our rocks over here we're not in Kansas City that's for sure we ain't in Kansas girl so Dorothy she's gonna try to get back to Kansas and there are her friends helping her so tell me what do you think about this I think it's beautiful I'm a great Wizard of Oz fan so I just had to have this in my stash yes I did so that's all I've got to show you today but keep tuned I'll be seeing you again before long you guys take care I love you and God bless bye